How's the song go? They're creepy and they're kooky, mysterious. And they're mm -hmm. We're not going to sing because no, Claudia sounds don't. awful. <laughs> the Adams <laughs> Family is the newest it. production to hit the stage at the Youth Theater uh, of Hardin County. It's their first performance since the pandemic hit. And here to give us a preview now is the director of the Youth Theater in Hardin County, Aaron Taylor, is joining us now. Hey, Aaron. Uh, good morning, guys. How are you? We're great, and I'm, we're just so excited for you all, right? Just to, to oh. be back together, to be performing again. You know, when you think of, of the Adams family and the story, this is a family that, that's very different, right? And they're coming together with very different backgrounds. And so we want yeah. to know a little bit about the background of the kids that make up your theater. Well, that's it. I mean, it's uh, we take in kids from all over Hardin County, middle school and high school, and uh, they uh, they turn out for auditions in April, and then we just kind of put everything together, and we get such a great melting pot. It's really, you just get to see, it's fascinating because you get the high school kids helping the middle school kids, and it just encourages the program, helps kids come up, and they're from all walks of life. It's it's a real melting pot. It's real fun to see. Yeah, when you say from all over Hardin County, that our show, we're going to do some work in Hardin County uh, uh, in a few weeks. We're excited about that. I, I think people forget how big mm -hmm. Hardin County actually <laughs> is. Uh, but right? you know, when, yeah. it, when it comes to being back on the stage for the first time, what does this production mean to the kids? Uh, it means a lot. They, You can tell. Uh, you know, when we started rehearsals for this, everybody was still wearing masks, and we just assumed we're going to be doing this show in masks and have to space out on stage. So once everything was lifted and the masks could come off and we could just rehearse a show and do a show, I mean, it throws them over the top. Their energy is through the roof and they're so excited to get back on stage and show people what they've been working on. Aaron, tell us a little bit about the show. What can people expect from it, the production and the message? Well, uh, the, the general plot is, and the general message is that family is family, family first and family last. Even if that means your family grows and changes a little bit, it's still your family, it's still all love, and just embrace it and care for it. And you know, Gomez and Morticia, you don't find two better parents than them. They just want the best for their kids, the best for their family, and, uh, whatever that means for them. And I think it's a great message to take out. I'm telling you, just from the staging and the makeup mm -hmm. and, and the wigs, I can't stop looking at Wednesday. <laughs> yeah. I, uh, yeah. it's, it's great. Hey, so I was surprised to learn this, and I think Claudia was too. The Youth Theater of Hardin County is the oldest youth theater program in the state. What does having these kids back on stage mean? We, we talked about what it means to the, to the kids, but what does this mean to the community? It... It just bolsters up the community. We've always had fantastic support through Hardin County. People really turn out to see the shows because they know they're going to get a high quality performance. I mean, youth might be in the name, but it's not in what you're seeing on stage. These kids, I would put it up against any show I've seen with adult actors, with grown-ups. It's just a ton of talent. So to have it back in the community, I think uh, we're really hoping for some big houses and getting a lot of people out here to come support it. Well, we can't stop looking at uh, your, your mustache <laughs> game, sir, <laughs> is on point. <laughs> we love it. Is it on point? Yes. All right, good, good, good. And okay. Aaron, I don't know if you know this or not, but back in the day, Eric and I both did a little bit of theater. <laughs> Poorly. Right? And so I'm just well, saying, on. I'm just throwing it out if you there. Need backup performers. Actually, I don't know if we would accept come a backup on, yeah, role. We'd please, have to warm. I don't do. know if we'd accept a backup role because we are meant to be stars. <laughs> um, sure, but yeah, yeah, but and so we would anytime take a walk on part. Please do. Please. <laughs> Well, Aaron, we've enjoyed talking to you. We're excited about the show. Mm -hmm. uh, we'll, we'll take the time to uh, once again remind people of, of all the details. Yeah, once again, the Great. Youth Theater of Hardin County summer production of The Adams Family runs on July the 9th, 10th, 15th, and 17th with a Sunday matinee on July the 11th. To reserve your seat, visit thepac.net.